wine weirdos. Christopher. We're checking out the 2010 Chenin Sauvignon Blanc. It's a Willamette, wine, Willamette Valley winemaker making wine in Mar Marlborough, uh, New Zealand. Who would have thought? That's a mouthful. <laughs> yeah. Talk about a mouthful. Talk about a nose. Folder. Yeah. It's Whoa. really it's, vibrant. It's getting more explosive as I, it opens up. Explosive is the word I can think. Uh, Fruit, dole fruits, the canned fruit salad. It's just monster tropical. Fruit. I get some key lime pie, but this is oh, the most no acidic doubt. key lime pie I've ever had. This There's, is zingy as can be. Totally, and kiwi, which is nice mm -hmm. too. On the palate. So. On the palate, go into this one. Wow, it's really getting some layers of complexity coming. Gain a little of a salin salinity quality, like ocean water sort of thing going on, which I'm liking. And it's more austere, as you guys have been saying, than. Mm -hmm. uh, your typical fruit forward Sauvignon Blanc from New Zealand. It's almost got a little bit of a, I was saying Loire Valley, you were saying Southern Rhone character mm -hmm. to it, which is really interesting. It's really got a heck of a finish. Tell me about it. I, you know, it's been about 15 seconds and you know, I'm accustomed to maybe a Sauvignon Blanc going maybe mm -hmm. 10, 15 seconds, but it is, it's actually, I think, escalating. The tartness, yeah. the sweetness, mm -hmm. the pith elements are just taking over my mouth. This is really, very well done wine. It's got the acidity of just ripe, really good grapefruit. No doubt. Yeah, not pink grapefruit either, but the real, the real stuff. And it's screaming for shellfish. Let yeah, me tell you. this is really a food wine in my opinion, mm -hmm. which is interesting. It's, mm -hmm. It would go very nicely uh, with any sort of shrimp salad thing like that. Um, any sort of sushi, the seaweed would be a lovely complement to it. And you were picking out uh, any sort of salad with nuts and berries. Yeah, proteins and maybe apple, a little... That would, crisp be, apple. that would be really great. This, this is a pretty amazing wine. I, I could see just sitting out in the porch, just, you know, taking a sip every three minutes. And, yeah. You know, and that's yeah. about as much often as you would need to sip it. Yeah, Peter at Shanann really has a home run with his uh, whites coming out of New Zealand. Great stuff uh, from a Willamette Valley winemaker. And we'll be back with more on Wine Weirdos. Cheers. Cheers.